mentioned in hadith that at the jar فَإِنَّهُ رَجَلُ الشَّاءُ He will be a young man. He will be a youngster. In another riwayah, in another narration, it's mentioned Shaykh al-Kabir, an old man. And both these narrations are authentic. He will be large and humongous in size. Red in color. And another narration, Abiyad Amhat, extremely white. So in one narration, you will be red. In another narration, you will be extremely white. But it's quite possible that he is human-like. He's like me and you. His figure and form will be like a human because he will have red cheeks and his skin color will be red. His hair is very short and he only has one eye. And about his eye, there are many hadiths that talk about the eye of the Jal. And Qadi Iyab, rahmatullahi ta'ala alayhi, he says that the right eye of the Dajjal has no light. It has no light, so he can't even see through it. As for the left eye, he doesn't even have a left eye. So, his Aynul Yumna has no light, and his Aynul Yusra is absent. He has no left eye. On his forehead will be written, Kaf Fa Ra. And in another narration, Kafir. And the Prophet وسلم, he talks about this in a hadith, which I would like to read before you. The Prophet وسلم, said, An Anas ibn Maliki, radiallahu ta'ala anhu, qala Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, ad-dajjalu mamsuhu al-ayn, maktubu al-bayna aynay kafirun, thumma tahajjaha kaf fa ra, yaqra'uhu kullu muslimin, Katibun or Ghaibun Katibun. The Prophet says in this hadith mentioning Sahih Muslim that the Jal will only have one eye. And written on his forehead, like I mentioned, will be the letters Kafara. Who will be able to read this? Every Muslim will be able to read this, regardless of whether he can read or he can't read. Every Muslim will be able to read this. This is what the Prophet said. His walking will be very long and great strides and he will walk unevenly. Even though his hair will be very short, his hair will be very short, but he will have a lot of hair on his head. And they say that the way his hair is, is like the branches on a tree. His hair will be so untidy that it will, it will look like the branches of a palm tree. And continuing with his description, it's mentioned that his eyes will sleep, but his heart will never sleep. His eyes will sleep, but his heart won't sleep. His ears will be 30 arm lengths long. This is all mentioned in a hadith. His ears will be 30 arm lengths long. And between each ear, there will be a gap of 40 arm lengths. Only one can imagine this, what he will look like. His ears will be 30 arm lengths long. And between each ear, there will be a gap of 40 arm lengths. As for his height, it's mentioned that his height will be 40 arm lengths tall. His height will be 40 arm lengths. He will have a donkey. This donkey is extremely fluffy of thick bushy hair. The distance between one hoof and another will complete a whole day and night. Between one hoof and another will be the distance of one day and night. And it, it will take one step. How long will it take one step? How long will this step be? According where the eyes of this donkey can see. So wherever the donkey can see, however far the donkey can see, this is where one stride of it will be. 